guys welcome to my channel and this episode is all about helmets yes the first protective accessories while riding the bike is helmet because head is precious so i'll tell you what helmet you should use and you shouldn't use so do watch this video up till the end so most of us uh, you know just go to the shop and buy this kind of helmet because this kind of helmet are quite cheap and is easily available over anywhere so this is the uh, there is enough room for your chin for your nose for your everything to breathe that's only protect your head uh, but this helmet is not good because when, when you're falling from your bike while uh, an accident so the first thing that will hit is the chin the chin is don't have any protection and you can see the belt it's also like so loose it's not tight at all so this for i think uh, this is a sleek helmet basically sleek you can see i don't know what it is called but uh, it is a sleek helmet it cost me around 250 to 300 rupees uh, in kolkata so it was my helmet i think since 7 8 years ago when i first bought my bike that time i also don't know about some protections how to protect myself but uh, sooner or the later I have realized that this helmet is of no use while riding in a long distance or in a city ride because accident can occur anytime so if you are not going for this helmet so you can go for the other helmet which I'll show which have a uh, you know two-way protection it also have like uh, this type of room and it also have a upper portion which you will connect uh, to make the whole face covered and it's basically of studs so let's see that helmet and if you're not comfortable with uh, this type of helmet you can also buy that type of because this helmet is not good not at all safe guys so so let's see the other helmet or if you're not satisfied with that helmet you can use this helmet because this helmet is a two-in-one it also gives you a room for your head and the straps are very good basically these are the studs 3g ninja helmet yeah it says like that and one so you can also use the half face like this or you can just pull it up and this is your full face you can see this will protect your chin while uh, accidents and it has also has the clear visor so you can see and the uh, inside of this helmet it's very good helmet but uh, I'll be not reviewing this helmet I'll be reviewing this helmet so basically this is the helmet what I'm talking about it is a full face helmet your chin is well protected your uh, head is well protected as well as it has some good padding and today I'll be reviewing this helmet and I'll show you that why it is important to use this helmet because this is a premium helmet and this will protect you from accidents at least better than the other two helmets so let's go A very good morning guys today's blog is gonna be uh, regarding something about my helmet I have been using this helmet since three years and I will make an honest review about this helmet so let's get started so the next thing I'll be starting by the visor the visor what I have attached it also comes with a uh, transparent visor but the visor which I have attached is a mercury one as you can see my own reflection uh, this happens because uh, you know like it is made up of a reflecting glass which is uh, good for daylight or uh, in hard sunlight so now let's see the uh, how the helmet feels from inside 
it feels good because it have much ventilations over all parts of the helmet so let's find out the first one the first one is this two as you can see this is completely adjustable and this is basically as you can see this this is uh, the ventilation you can see now it's clear this is the ventilation one and it has like two okay and in the back side also it has a ventilation you can see this all things are the ventilations as you can also uh, close up when it is needed and you can open it when you are going for rides you know like it is all adjustable and it also has the front one as it is the most important ventilation because uh, we breathe through our nose over here and this is the ventilation as you can see yes so this is basically the ventilation and the padding of this helmet is quite soft uh, you can find this is quite soft sorry I, it is not a new helmet I have been using this for three years so that's why the padding condition is like this but all over the helmet feels very good uh, let's see the inside view of the helmet uh, so you can see the inside view of the helmet is completely covered with padding and soft padding over your head like this this is the soft padding over your head and this is the padding on your forehead it is quite soft as you can see and it is the like your back uh, yes this is the padding of the of your back head it will protect your back head and everything is placed in a proper way coming to the lock of the helmet you can see basically this is the lock and it has some layers in it you can adjust according to your chin according to your face adjustment and this is basically the lock the lock is quite premium and it is uh, very easy to lock Just showing you with one hand i'm trying okay like let's see uh, i'm just putting it one hand and i'll apply some pressure and you can see this had been attached in the one i'm using my one hand and i'm attaching this so it's very simple you can use your both hand also coming back to the graphics and the quality of the graphic as you can see this is a skeleton and my helmet is uh, based of a skeleton theme black and red so the paint quality of the helmet is so good you can see it is gloss after three years also the paint and the graphics remain the same they have not been you know like faded away so the quality of the paint is quite good thing which i modified is uh, the upper uh, portion of the helmet this thing this thing is basically known as the helmet horn or you can get it in uh, Amazon I have got in Amazon and I have mounted this with uh, cello tape and 3m tape and it looks like this and looks quite attractive you know and uh, basically it's a aerodynamic design you can see this aerodynamic design so wind can flow like this so it will help you to you know so it will help you to uh, thing which I modified is uh, the upper uh, portion of the helmet this thing this thing is basically known as the helmet horn or you can get it in uh, Amazon I have got in Amazon and I have mounted this with uh, cello tape and 3m tape and it looks like this and looks quite attractive you know and uh, basically it's a aerodynamic design so it also comes with this uh, cover or you can say you can cover it up and the material of this cover is very good you can just it is not waterproof first of all uh, but it is quite water resistant and we will quickly see that how it looks and uh, let's go so it looks like this and uh, you can see this is the basically the logo of the helmet yohi helmet and uh, it has also a logo in uh, the back side so it looks premium and there is uh, adjuster you can just pull it and you can just adjust it according to 
your uh, your need so um, basically this is the view of the uh, helmet in the cover so basically uh, what i am trying to say is that this helmet is quite good but still it's a local made helmet this is a gift from my uncle he gifted me this helmet so he doesn't know about so much uh, so he gifted me this helmet i'm quite satisfied with this helmet but it is a local made and you know that the local made are not good but yeah i am quite comfortable with this helmet but you do not make the mistake you go for something uh, with a good price tag this cost me around 4500 as told by my uncle it cost him around 4500 for this helmet and uh, in 4500 you can get a good helmet like MT, Soul, THH, AGV, AGV I think it's uh, like higher than that. So the main motive of telling you that, that your head is very precious, don't just take the risk, use a good helmet, you know when accident gonna occur and you need protection for your head and use this type of full face helmet, don't use a half face helmet. So. With that said guys, thank you for watching this video. If you find this video helpful, then please give the video a thumbs up. Don't forget to share, subscribe and comment. So anyways, this is your Bong Biker signing off and I'll meet you in the next vlog. Till then, tata and ride safe and ride hard. Take a hat to say, Ask, my kid, take a limb, a salamary chart to me. Pagia, fish a party, the 